and welcome to One Heart Heroes. This is Wade. And this is Cody. Ladies and gentlemen, we now have determination. Woo! We've, uh, we've killed everything. In the area anyways. Mm-hmm. Kind of. In the general vicinity. But nobody came. It's odd that you still get, like, random encounters. Like, what the fuck are you randomly encountering? Nothing. Well, I guess that's what I'm saying. Like, you run into a dust bunny? Well, basically, it's just to, um, emphasize the fact that there's nobody there. There's, like, you have literally wiped out an entire, like, group of people. Gotcha. Hello, this is Toriel. <coughs> For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Wait, don't tell me. It's butterscotch. No. Yes. E I had a feeling. That's Should've from. Said no. That's well. Why would I do that? When humans fall down here, strangely, I. I often feel like I already know them. Truthfully, when I first saw you, I felt like I was seeing an old friend for the first time. Oh wow. Strange, is it not? Well, thank you for your selection. Pretty sure that's what it said before. It's not. <laughs> like, whenever we played through this last time. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not. With the hour long that we lost. Not sure. Continue. Hello, this is Toriel. You do not like, you do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient. By the way. I read that incorrectly. <laughs> yeah. It happens. But nobody came. Uh-huh. Oh, that's not the sassy rock. Hello? You don't have any allergies, do you? Huh? Why am I asking? No reason. No reason at all. Okay, maybe she's done calling. God, I can only hope so. Otherwise, we'll have to deal with, uh, like, more questions about butterscotch and candy. You know, really, she seems kind of like that creepy pedophile that, uh, you know, comes by and is like, You want some candy, kid? Like, she's abducting you in a fucking dungeon and asking you what kind of candies you like. Oh, uh, to be fair, she didn't abduct you. Right, right, she just, like, lured you away and is offering you butterscotch and cinnamon. Fuck. She didn't lure you away. You fell into this hole. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then a happy little sunflower tried to help you and she beat it up. Um. And then is offering you candy like a, like a creepo. Cody, I don't believe you're remembering this right. Yeah, man. He tried to hug me with pellets. Yeah, he did. He also tried to kill you with those hug pellets. You don't know that. I, but I do. <laughs> you don't. Whoa there, partner. Said you could push me around. Hmm? Oh, so you're asking me to move over. Alright, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Uh. Why did you move with it? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> Invisible walls? <laughs> sure. That's the wrong direction? Okay, I think I got it. Boom. Mm -hmm. And then assassination. <laughs> Tried to kill you. If anything, I should kill this rock. Hmm? You wanted me to stay there? And you kill a rock. Give me a real workout. Turn it into rubble. But or then there's just pound a lot it of into dust. There's just a lot of sassy rocks. Termination. Like we don't know if the uh if like destroying it counts on the whole. Cheese has been here quite a long like, time. Destroy its sentience. Stick to the table. Uh, the thought of the mouse eventually reaching the cheese no longer fills me with determination. It instantly just disappoofed. Yeah, man, he didn't want to fuck with that. At least I got some cash this time. I'm surprised you can't strong arm the spiders. I mean, technically they're not there. <laughs> Why do you say that? Oh, you're just... That's just like it's in a donut. Yeah, you leave it in the web and then... Oh, well. They crawled, they gave you the donut. Yeah, man. Hmm. They're not there at the time of purchase. You leave the money and then they bring it to you. But you're still there when they bring it to you. I guess you can squish them whenever they're running away. Yeah, man. Take your money. 
Then you can't get you more. You use Grand Theft Auto logic. Yeah, but then you can't get any more. That's why there's, there's other prostitutes on the street. I mean, there's no other there, webs. But there's never other spiders, though. Mm. I just realized that it's been a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying around there, here and there. You can pick them up, but don't carry more than you need. Someday you might find something you really like, and you'll want to leave it. Uh, you'll want to leave room in your pockets for that. Ah, okay. And nobody came. Wait, I'm about to say, probably could have made it through most of this dungeon. Oh, we're still making it through most of this dungeon. I mean, like the first episode. Instead of stopping in the one room. There's a, uh, a wee bit of uh, area that we could have covered. That's true. I mean, well, now... These handy dandy encounters. Now we just have to... Uh, have to walk through it. Yeah. Silently. Yeah. With the, it's like you've done this before. And uh, silently walking through the the thing. N no, knowing where the switch was. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, man. Yeah. Everyone's like these puzzles. Are Wait, he's what? Why? How do you know there was one behind the thing? <laughs> it's like we've done this before. I mean. Technically, I haven't. You have. Well, actually, and you've I, watched like twenty other people do it. I have too, but right, you have, haven't you? Yeah. Once, at least. Actually, <laughs> twice. Green switch. When'd you do it twice? Um, the second time. Well, this is the 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 second time was the the for the genocide run the first time. The um the first time was whenever I had to go through and get us back to our place whenever the game did the funky thing that it did and we had to, and we lost all that video the first time. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Huh. Yeah, we had an accident where we lost a lot of uh, a lot of uh, recorded Undertale. Like three hours. Oh dear. That took longer than I thought it would. I was probably chasing down that dog. Right. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Not a scratch. Impressive, but still. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try and surprise you like this. Uh, well, I suppose I can't hide it any longer. Come, small one. Not gonna ask about all the dust all over me. Look like I've been rolling around in an uh, open vacuum bag. Nah. Children get dirty. Do you smell that? Surprise! It's butterscotch cinnamon pie. Who the thong? I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I just want you to have a nice time living here. So I'll hold off on the snail pie for tonight. Ooh. I mean... Aren't they supposed to like burst with flavor in your mouth? Yeah, but in a pie formation, I just... And then a lot of them will burst with flavor in your no, mouth. No, Here, I have another surprise for you. It's probably like mutton pie or whatever. That's completely different, Wade. <laughs> this is it. Well, it's meat, right? Yeah, but it's not slimy. It might not be slimy. Wait, the snails I had were like... Delicious garlic-flavored boogers. Mmm. Slimy and they pop in your mouth. That sounds appealing. You don't want a pie made of that. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Rub, rub. Is something burning? Make Only yourself my soul. <laughs> what are you talking about? He has no soul. <sighs> it's down in hell, Wade. Nah. Doesn't no? exist. <laughs> right, because you brought it onto the underground. That is the most unhappy looking pillow. It does look like an angry pillow. It is not pleased that the monster that you are has slept upon it. I'm going to quit calling you, so I'm going to have to call you something besides a monster. Yeah, because monsters are good in this place. Yeah, man. The human that you are. Up already, I see. Um, You want to know how glad I am to have someone here? 
There's so many old books that I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? <coughs> Excuse me. What is it? When can I go home? What? You're a very lonely lady, aren't this, you? This is your home now. Would you like to hear about this book that I'm reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. Mm -mm. How about it? How, how it about snails? how we can leave? How exciting. Uh, how about an exciting snail fact? I'm good. Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? Interesting. Later. So it is a different snail fact each time. <laughs> it is. Look at that mouth go. I... So this is what lips feel like. Right? I have, <laughs> I have something to do. I have to do something. Stay here. You're not suspicious at all, Toriel. See, like, I know, like, I know why Cody's putting on this tough act, guys. Like, it's it has come to me. Mm. Because, like, if Cody were to feel for her as he did the first time, it would break his heart whenever we had to do the deed. There was no feeling the first time. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be good. Uh, now be a good child and go upstairs. I don't believe you. What? That you should be a good child? No, I don't. I said you. Oh me? Yeah, you. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I'm only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. Asgore's such an asshat. He really is. A lazy asshat at that. Right? <laughs> do not try and stop me. This is your final warning. <laughs> yeah? You want to leave so badly. Hmm. You're just like all the others. Nah. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. If I was yourself. like all the others, you wouldn't be around. Prove to me that you're strong enough to survive. Wait. Why are you looking at me like that? Like you've seen a ghost? Do you know something that I do not? Oh dear. Awesome. The dialogue changed. Oh shit. No. Th that is impossible. Hmm. Oh, okay. I thought it was gonna immediately fucking kill her, and I was like, whoa! Right in the back. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> yeah, man, that was, uh... Whoa. <laughs> huh. Alright, it's a little bit more of a dialogue change. I wonder if she'll kill me. I seriously doubt it. She's too nice of a cow, or a goat mom, to do that. Then again, you can always try and find out. Well, like, this is the easiest way to do it. What? Is this see if... Well, no, just, kill you? just to go through... Oh, well, yeah. I'm sure. Let's say, just be a complete asshat. Just sit still. Yeah, man. Are you ready for this? Are you ready, everyone, for the murder? For the pain? Or the feelings of despair. What are you proving this way? That, uh... Hmm. Prepares a magical attack. Fight me or leave. What are we trying to prove this way, Wade? Um... That we're not that like love, the others? That love overcomes all? Oh, Undertale joke. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Toriel looks through you. Stop it. Not no, doing anything. Can't do it yet. Um, <laughs> Literally, you. I feel like you're just sitting there staring at her. Stop looking at me that way. Well, basically, I am. Like getting a flamethrower to the face. Around the face. Well, to be fair, she hit you in the face with it a couple times. <laughs> she did. Like, you're probably you're sitting there and like, you're just kind of blistered, bleeding. Just still staring at her. You're really creepy, honestly, in my mind. Quite. 
excuse me. Like, so it's your little atrocity. I was about to say monster again, but that's not the proper word. I know you want to go home, but... But... Knife! <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, get out the way. You. At my most vulnerable moment. To think I was worried you wouldn't fit in out there. Ooh, that crazy. <laughs> you really are no different than the... Than the... the you're not going to go M? Mm. <laughs> That's sad. Bet she lost her ever-loving mind right at the end, yeah. I mean, it, it's sad that she took somebody in out of the kindness of her heart and they murdered her. This is like the thing that you hear about hobos doing. Happy murder door. Happy murder door? That door was so happy to see her die. Oh, happy murder door, gotcha. I thought you were doing like, happy Christmas, or happy Christmas, happy birthday, like, happy murder door. Is that going to be a thing for us? Happy murder door! <laughs> Stick a knife in them. I hope that's not a thing. Hey, Wade. You know, hey, <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out how you decorate for that holiday. With knives. And doors. And earlobes. Earlobes? Yeah, man. Why earlobes? I have a nice necklace. Whoa. <laughs> Credits. Woo! Alright, everyone. This was actually a full-length episode this time. <laughs> um, civilians, if you want to be heroes, all you have to do is click the watermark in the bottom right-hand corner, or the big heart on the end slate. Civilians... Wait, no. I fucked that up, didn't I? <laughs> civilians, do what I just told the heroes to do. <laughs> heroes, thank you for watching. Um... <laughs> Tweet at us one of our heroes with the number one. Uh, leave a comment, Wade. What should the comment be? Question of the day. What is more heartbreaking to see? For me to gain Toriel's trust and kill her, or for me to fight her from the beginning and to watch her not be willing to kill me as I continue to murder her? What's more devastating? Probably gaining her trust and killing her. Just saying. I don't know. Part of me feels like it's a little more heartbreaking to see someone still not be willing to kill you even though you are steadily murdering them. I feel like you're more of a monster the other way. To be fair. Like, one way, you're an honest sociopath. The other way, you're just evil. You make a very good point, I guess. At least your intentions are out there. One way. All right. That Later, is. heroes. Build a beat, everyone. How about we? Uh, how you, about we just? I encountered the dummy. Kill it. With extreme prejudice. Boom. Hmm. 